Hello YouTube, today I'll be showing you a tanning leather money making guide at the Portable Crafters. So you're basically going to be tanning various dragon leather and so there are no requirements. However, it does require a lot of starting upfront cash. So in order to get the Portable Crafters, they're from Treasure Hunter or you can simply buy it off the GE. Ideally you want to share them and there's a friend chat called Portables FC. There's also a spreadsheet that tracks portable locations which is also owned by the Portables FC and I'll leave that link in the description. Alright, so I'm gonna get into the strategy. You wanna create a bank preset full of dragon hides. Then configure the left click option on the portable crafter. So, in order to do that, you just right click the portable crafter and select the left click option. Then select that as tan hides. So, as of an update in February 2017, the portable crafters have a configure left click option. Now, what you wanna do is position your camera so that you left click the portable crafter without actually having to close the bank interface. So basically you're just going to hit the bank preset key, then click the portable crafter right away. Make sure you hold the spacebar immediately after you hit the preset key. Pretty much just click the bank chest and keep repeating basically. As you can see it's really fast to tan the dragon hides and it's extremely click intensive. Yeah I know it kind of sucks if it lags though. In terms of profit analysis, it really depends on the color of the dragon hides. I use black dragon hides in this video, and each hide costs you 20 GP. There's a profit calculator on the Wikia and I'll leave that link in the description. However, because of buy limits, you're definitely going to have to use different colored hides as it's 10k every 4 hours. I did actually use my free to play alts to help me buy the black dragon hides. So in 45 minutes, I was able to tan 39k hides. If you were to extrapolate this in an hour, you would tan 52k hides. I was only able to do 45 minutes, because yeah I didn't have enough starting cash. I was actually nearly perfect with the clicks. I believe it used to be 25k per hour, but now with the ability to left click the tan hides, it's actually more than double that. Of course, there's a less chance of misclicking too, you gotta factor that in. I made 200 GP every hide, and so this will give me a whopping 10 mil profit per hour. Generally speaking, I think you can expect 100 to 150 GP profit per hide, so it's like 5 mil GP per hour. On double XP weekend though, you can expect larger margins, so that way it's a really great money making method. For some reason the black dragon leathers do take a while to sell, so I kinda highly suggest you be patient selling them. They really have fairly unstable price margins as you can probably see. Also, I highly suggest you don't buy the dragon leather hides over a long period of time because the prices do change a lot and you might end up losing money. So like try to tan the hides immediately after buying them, and sell them immediately after you tan them. That way it stays up to date with the prices. So is this method worth it overall? Well it's very click intensive and it really requires a huge upfront cost. I believe it costed me approximately 150 mil starting cash. Honestly though, it's a really great method for low skill requirements and low combat requirements. If you're planning to train crafting with dragon leathers, then yeah I actually think it's worth it to buy the dragon hides and tan them yourself, because of how many you can tan every hour nowadays. So yeah, thanks for watching and I hope it helps. If I missed anything feel free to ask.